I'm Nick. And I'm Mel. And this is The Hot Desk. This East Coast rapper has sold millions across the world. He's broken records, won awards, has a clothing line, mines his own diamonds, and has set up his own school in Africa. Next step, world domination. Who is it, Mel? It's Akon! Welcome, Akon, to The Hot Desk. Welcome. Um, before we start the interview, we always ask the artist um, to pick a song they'd like to play underneath the interview. Cool. And when you think of one, if you don't mind, just clicking your fingers to the camera and it will come on magically. Cool. We don't care. See? It's cool. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> so your new album, Freedom, like pretty much all of your other albums, is doing really well. Can you explain a little bit about the new album? What's it all about? Why, yeah. why is it called Freedom? Well, the new album is more international. I'm more mature. Okay. More party. More mature and party. Yeah, let's see. There's a bit of a see. juxtaposition there because some people with partying, youth, maturity. This is maturity party. Slippers and a pipe and an armchair. <laughs> okay, you're an entrepreneur mm -hmm. and appear to have the Midas touch. Um, here is 10 pounds. <laughs> Can you tell me how to make a million? A million? Are this yes. 10? Yeah. 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 First, I would go to the casino. Okay. And at least get a thousand pounds. <laughs> if I lose this 10 at the casino, then I wasn't meant to be a millionaire. I can keep this? Yes, you can. Yes, you can. We say that you can. And what happens when I make the million out of it? I just come back and give you back the 10? Well, we've kind of written in a contract and kind of, we took a bit we'll of your DNA it. and if like, you, we'll if you make contract. a million on that 10 pounds, we have to split it. So you signed Lady Gaga to your, is it Con Live or Con Live? Con Live. Con Live label. You must be really pleased with her success, obviously. That was a good question, by the way. Um, what is it about Lady Gaga that's got everyone so excited? Or Gaga. Gaga. Yeah, it's Gaga. Just, it's that's what got everybody excited, Gaga. Gaga. Not the lady, Gaga. the Gaga, the Gaga, not the lady. If you were stranded on a desert island, but were allowed to take three things, what would you choose? A fishing rod. Okay, there we go. Then there I can we go. Catch but now you're thinking what we got. A jet ski, because I love jet skis on the water. Okay. And a hot babe. If you could create a dream headline of yourself in the national press, what would it be? Hmm. Hedicon donates a couple billion to Africa. There you well, go. Well, there you go. That would be a great idea. Or well, something to do with your school, because you, you've, you've started a school, right? Yeah, definitely, you know, through rebuilding Africa somehow. Amazing. Um, we're going to play a game. Mm. Um, have you ever? Okay, so I'm going to start. Have you ever spent more than one million dollars in a day? No. Have you ever made a small child cry? Yeah. It could be a happy cry, right? No, That's what I was thinking. Uh, have you ever made um, a private movie? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> have you ever stolen anything? Yeah. Have you ever dated a celebrity? No. Have you ever had a proper fist fight? All the time. <laughs> Have you ever been a prima donna? No. Have you ever had your heart broken? Yeah. Have you ever regretted being in the bed you woke up in? Well, in my case, I want to stay in the bed I woke up in. <laughs> so, no so I'm not, well, before maybe. It depends on the, you know, So let's say yes. The company. It okay. depends, exactly. No, sometimes, but exactly. So in my case, you I ever like the bed, I'll, you know. Just just sometimes the, you don't like who you or, woke yeah. up in it with. That's yeah. Or this red count. <laughs> that may be a, you know. Uh, have you ever wished you weren't famous? Sometimes. Mm -hmm. Have you ever regretted finishing a relationship? Mm. This is our kind of like Oprah question where you're supposed to start crying a bit. No, I'm not thinking about not really. Because it takes a lot for me to finish a relationship. Like, so if it happened, believe me, it was it was a good fully reason. exhausted. Right, yeah. okay. Uh, have you ever kissed a good friend's girlfriend passionately? <laughs> I might have. He's really took so long to say yes no, or no. No, sometimes, you know, it's... I said passionately, so it's definitely right. tongues. Yeah, inappropriately. <laughs> it depends. That's a yes. <laughs> have you lied during this interview? No. Okay. No, that's, that's very good. You've had a few random jobs before you became famous. You used to work in a barber shop? Yeah. What were you doing? Were you like a proper barber? No, I used to actually did cut you wash hair. It? You could cut hair as well. Mm. So if you hadn't become Akon, is that what you'd be doing now? No. What would you be doing? I don't know. I'll be hustling though somehow. Did you ever have another passion apart from music that you sort of... Basketball. Oh, right, okay. Yeah. And football. So, like soccer, football, or yeah. American football? 
No, British football. Oh, good. Really? Yeah, you can't compare American oh, football. Oh, I don't know. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I used to live over there. I don't know. It's not even like they can't even compare it. So what team do you support over here? Chelsea. Hello. Yeah. Have you been to matches and stuff over here? Absolutely. Another quick fire round for you? That's good. Okay, another quick fire. Okay. These are your favorite things. Your favorite drink? Shirley Temple. Oh, I, I like her Shirley Temple. Um, favorite sandwich filling? Cheese. Okay. Like a cheese sandwich. I love a cheese sandwich. <laughs> favorite color underwear? Black. Okay. Favorite season of the year? Summer. Okay. Favorite smell? Depends. Favorite smell? <laughs> it uh... depends. <laughs> now, if it's a flavor to smell, this is probably pina colada. Okay, mm -hmm. coconutty, tropical, yes. holiday. That yeah. reminds me of holiday, straight exactly. away. Uh, favorite place to wake up? In my bed. Mm -hmm. Favorite my number? Two. What's your ringtone? My ringtone? Uh, oh, you got to hear this. Oh, okay. come on then. Someone Somebody got to call me. You are not someone else. Someone else is someone else. You are you. <laughs> Finally, we play this game called Call Back, Text or Reject. Gotcha. Um, where they've called you and they want to collaborate with you. Gotcha. So the names are Phil Collins. Definitely call back. Rihanna. Call back. And Beyonce. Call back. Right, you're not allowed to call all of them back. You can call back one, one. text, text one, back one, and reject one. And one of them. I don't want to reject you. Don't reject one, Everybody again. does it. But I don't want to reject it's either one. It's the game. But I don't want to reject either one. All right. I'll text Phil Collins back. Okay. Okay. Because okay. mm. if he probably wouldn't pick up if I called anyway, he's probably too busy. <laughs> um. Oh, between Rihanna and Beyonce, who's getting the nah. callback and who's not? I'll probably. Yeah. I probably call Rihanna. All right, so you oh, right. reject Beyonce. Yeah. Okay. All that's left to do is sign the desk. Sign the desk, please, sir.